Hi everyone, today's unboxing and review is going to be of the Ever After High Forest Pixies. Um, I got all three of them quite recently um, from um, Toys R Us. They were just under £4 each, normally they're £10 each. Um, and I got Harlow or Harlow, Featherly and Dealer. I'm going to open Dealer and we'll have a look at her because I should imagine that they're all the same. Their body types and everything, they do look the same, don't they? Um, let's open them and have a look. We'll open this one because she's my favourite. <laughs> yeah, she is. Right, so I've opened the bottom and she does think, yeah, she just slides out. So there she is on her background. She's not. She's got elastic at her feet, elastic at her waist, and the obligatory. There's only two in there, so it's not too bad. We'll cut them from the back so that we don't cut her hair. That's not too bad, is it? So there's Dealer. She's got nice soft hair. There's no product in that hair at all. There's the two ooh, things. She's got her antlers which are attached to her head, yeah, and her ears, little gold ears and antlers. She's got little white freckles and pink lips. She's got on a little removable belt. We can take that off. Her shoes are removable too. They're quite cute those shoes, aren't they? Teeny tiny shoes. Let's have a look at her feet if we can get her shoes off. Right. Yeah, she's got quite small, delicate little feet like you'd expect her to have. Yeah, she's got no articulation apart from the basic five points of articulation. She's got an elastic holding her hair to her arm again. Yeah, these are Mattel, made by Mattel. Give her a snip. Right, so her dress is a one-piece dress. It's like a, a stretchy jersey fabric with a little um, net, delicate net frill for the sleeves. Velcro fastening at the back. Really nice colour, like a peacock colour that is, it reminds me of. Even though she's the dear one, yeah. Now her body, she's got a really teeny tiny little body. She's, like I say, no articulation in her arms, in her elbows, hands, knees or feet and I have considered swapping the heads with um, perhaps a Monster High doll yeah to see if although so having said that I don't think that the hole in the head would be big enough I'd have to change the hole in the head and I don't think I want to do that so yeah maybe that's not an option after all but yeah she comes with moulded on pants she's got 2015 Mattel on the back of her head yeah, and on her body it says 2015, made in Indonesia. Yeah, so that's her, and I should imagine that the others are very similar. Let's get them out and have a look, shall we? One's not held in her. She hasn't got any in her head. No, that's good, isn't it? She's got marks on the back of her head, though. Look, like that looks like some kind of staining all on the back of her head and all around here. Look, you couldn't see that in from the box, but yeah, she has. She's got some kind of staining on her there. She's got box hair because it's been in there. She's got a little tiny bird in her hair. Look, that's cute, isn't it? And lovely curly hair. Yeah, her belt too is removable and her dress too. And again, no articulation. She's got really cute little shoes on. They're nice, aren't they? I like those. And she's got like coral accessories. No earrings in these dolls. Yeah, she's got peachy lips to match her, her uh, accessories. Yeah, I wonder what that is. I hope that comes off because that's... I don't know what it is. Yeah. It's a shame that she's got like uh, around this eye she's got some decoration yeah she, yeah 
yeah and then we've got Harlow I like that hello Harlow I like the name of that yeah so here's her all of the boxes are the same and all of the backgrounds to the boxes are the same yeah let's snip her out it's just four snips one two three I don't even think there is one that side. There's only three snips for that one then. Oh, she's got this on the inside of her for some reason. Not sure what that's in aid of, but anyway. An extra snip there it is. Oh, it's holding her hair down. Yeah, just pull that off. Right. So she's got her, her ears are attached to her head and they're silver. Her hair's nice and smooth and silky she's just got a bit of box hair yeah there's no no product in that she's got a really cute little face hasn't she she's got a she's a supposed to be a hair but she reminds me of a mouse her face does yeah because it's small and pink yeah she's got one of those tags in her head yeah and she's got like deep burgundy well deep pink stroke burgundy accessories she's got wearing little boots i like those teeny tiny little feet they've got so I, I should imagine that you could um swap their clothes over if you wanted to yeah no articulation as i said and it, it's that plasticky material again plasticky body arms and legs and then they've got the vinyl head yeah really like those though for four pounds it was a bargain wasn't it yeah and they're all wearing wearing the same accessories and the same style of dress. They're all one-piece dresses with the Velcro fastening at the back. They've all got shoes and they've all got belts, so yeah. So that was my unboxing and review of Ever After High Forest Pixies. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.